Oh my gosh, I timed that out so poorly. <laughs> ah, we are getting underway with Operation Wicked Gardens. This is B-Car. Got, uh, got some good stuff for you today. Wicked Gardens is a classic. We've been going back to some classics here and uh, getting back into the... Uh, the back catalog of operations as uh, a few things are still in the works uh, in various locations. Um, this is going to be British versus uh, insurgents on Camdash. Something completely different. So we got a few different uh, lanes here. We've got um, a red lane, a yellow lane, and a green lane. I Maybe they have names, I completely forget. Anyway, there are um, nine suspected uh, training camps in this area. The Brits are gonna clear the way for a route to get from east to west or west to east, whichever way. Um, they're going to uh, make sure that they can clear the route. Um, all the routes, uh, all the uh, camps on the route have to be cleared. Um, and there's a varying level of severity of the routes as far as their capabilities. Their, um, the routes have different, um, can have different uh, fobs and stuff like, or fobs, and the fobs can have some sort of fortifications or emplacements. Um, they have to be cleared in order, and the Brits can't change their mind after the say the word go. Uh, Brits loadouts here, two FTLs, one medic. Um, also platoon levels of ARs and machine guns that may have changed due to the fact that we are operating on a vanilla layer. Uh, I'm just going to double check here. Uh, no, it does not. So two AR, eight ARs and two medics for the entire platoon. Um, once they get to the last checkpoint, they get a mortar. Um, so good stuff there. INS on the other hand, nothing. Aside from each lane has a varying level of FOB logistics available to it. Or INS. Uh, Camp Red has uh, no uh, logistics. Camp Yellow has a mortar and sandbags. Camp Green is two HMG. So the idea is they're just, it's not really nine possible locations. There's only three locations. But one of them has to be placed on each route. Excuse me. And uh, we are starting a little bit late here compared to everyone else. Uh, it's just after 1500 hours Eastern. We'll go ahead and get into cam here. Okay, there we go. We'll ignore that when it's freaking out. Hello, welcome again to Wicked Gardens. Uh, we're in our valley here setting up our training camps. The British found out we have some bases in this valley and they're going to try and take them from us, which is, which is no bueno. Um, so if you open up your maps, please, I'll show you how we're going to beat the sneaky tea drinkers. So, starting off alive in the south, we will have Hovis and Headbusta squad starting at the southeastern point. Off of live, Hovis is going to move to the southwest ridge, which he's marked with the form. I'll mark it. With the machine gun marker, they're going to cover that southwestern flank in the map border as well as that town. Uh, Headbuster will be on the southeast point proper and a bit to the east, marked by the helmet marks. Nope, someone put helmet marks down. Marked by the lap marks. He's going to be defending that point as well as the eastern map border. Border. Those two are really going to cover that corner of the map. In the middle, we will have Sven's squad plus me and my guy with the mortar pit. We're really just going to be trying to provide an anchor for the rest of the team to move around with. He's going to cover mainly the east. Moving up to, the, up to the north, we have Revy Squad and Cartel Squad. Revy with the two Dishka Techies is going to be covering the northwestern ridge and flank. Those fob markers are really going to be a bit more mobile, watching in case the British come west and go all the way around. Cartel is going to be more closer in on the east flank with the skull markers and covering the east. We know the British are coming from the east or west, we don't know. Yep. Yeah, maybe move away from that one in case it blows. Just shift over this way. Shift. Oh, yeah, shift over here, guys. Well, we're we're all equal height here. It's okay. Basically, we're gonna 
We know the British start from one side, we don't know which. We're gonna prepare for an eastern flank. If we don't see anything then, we'll sh shift over to the west. Um, these are our points, these are our homes, so we do want to defend these locations. We don't want to, we can't fall, can't afford to fall back or else the Brits will destroy our training camps. Any questions? No? No, no questions? Brits have armor. Brits, uh, I believe, no, I believe this is a foot patrol. They have significantly more firepower than we do, though. They do. So that's do we have a Yeah, I do have some oh, sorry, emplacements. Yeah. We have mortars and HMGs and dishkas. Uh, the train here really favors defense, so just you know, lots of ridges. Find a spot where you have the advantage, and just hold that position. Worst comes to worst, we can fall back into the towns. We don't know which yeah. route are they patrolling, so you may need to move to relocate and support another. Uh, an another small village. Yeah, we choose where oh, we like fight, a... so we have an advantage. Yeah, so we're gonna play our cards close to our chest. We're not gonna. Not yet. I still gotta get there slowly. I'm briefing. And then. Okay. So yeah, we're gonna keep our cards close to our chest. Let them come to us, and then we're just gonna let hell hell let loose on these guys. All right, that's about it. Um, vehicles should be ready to go. Your squad leaders know which vehicles to take, and have fun. I don't know. Yellow route A. I don't know either. I don't know why they say yellow route. Like I'm gonna go pull up the map. Wait, hold on. It. I'm gonna pull up the map. The yellow paper, Green. of course. It was the middle one. Ah. On the briefing. There Green. were there were three routes. The southern map border was one. <laughs> Look, all I heard was the color yellow. red, yellow, and green. So I can be uh, yep. blue route, best route. All right, we got command comms now. We're going to be listening in. Uh, Athol running British for round one here. We got Killer J, Oddball, Legar, Frost, and Mr. Raggy. Going to be running some squads. Looks like we're just about at capacity. Uh, on the other side. Uh, Dash B is running INS with Sven, Hovis, Cartel, Headbusta, and Revy. Um, Sorry, which one's the suppressive force? Oh, wrong button. Dang on it. Uh, we are going to be starting here shortly. I, I would imagine. And, uh, get information already with the three online and the two support wins. Squad 5 called that. <laughs> now that we have uh, command comms, we'll be able to hear what's going on. And, uh, it should be good. I have faith that uh, Aethel can pull this through. Nerd. This operation, it, it's kind of, that calls for an execution. Oh, it's kind of, it's kind of crazy. The idea that more than six more players, uh, like one more player, maybe. Um, but the idea that, um, see the yellow route is interesting to me because you're basically committing to also clearing green or causing problems on if there's a camp in the green area as you move through. Now there's gonna be only three camps. If they get lucky and the red camp is forward, or it is actually in the back, this is perfect for us. could be problems. Right the front, the AR um, if they bypass the red camp early, like say if the red camp was... Medic actually, we don't know. Can we see the map here? No. He's no. a combat medic. Oh, INS are still moving out. No, no, no. Oh, because we are on a vanilla lair. Um, Discord, squadops.gg slash Discord, right? Or is it discord.gg slash squadops? It's one of the two. How insane would that have been if I, if British started the uh, East? Just so you guys know, British could start at Maine or they could start here. Let's go right guys, okay. And then there's like three routes that the re thing has to go along. Ding, ding, ding. Yes. And then here, here, and here. <laughs> now we can go. <laughs> and all of the, 
patrol bases are over here on the east. So we're gonna chill. There's gonna be zero contact in. There goes, there's gonna be zero contact for a while, guys. I'm over to your right. Right, after you guys cross the road, switch into an actual formation in line. Because they will have eyes. No, they won't. They will not have eyes. It is not happening. They will not have eyes. It's what it is. This is a one life operation, by the way. So. We play two rounds. We'll play round one, and then we will uh, switch sides and. The uh, INS for round one, we get to play as Brits for round two. So we'll just, uh, I guess we'll just like zoom down here and just like uh, every once in a while I'll glance at the map. Now there's gonna be, looks like INS has some VIX moving out. I wouldn't be surprised if they just held on. They're on patrol, only one guy in that truck. Right, the Glor and the Killer. Where's his gunner? Is this guy just... Where's this guy's gunner? Copy that, we don't want to be stacked up here. Okay. They're doing good. Um, you may move at whichever base you want for now. Uh, that's right. For this operation, we're not allowing them to have a commander. Yeah, I was gonna go move my team. Um, There's no, uh... For this operation, there's no, um... I always look good. What? Doesn't matter where you're going, as long as you look at doing it. Yep. I'm right, just walking Maggie, towards the northeast, towards 75. Um, let, uh, kill your oddball and, uh, let get in line. Got it. I don't know if you are already, but, uh... I mean, it's gonna take I a little while, guys. Yeah. It's gonna be like... 10 15 minutes until I think Aethel decides yeah, to realize that the so um, drop down and see if I can get him. Oh, yeah, the game has been uh, the game has been played. What do you have? Do you have the in a certain fashion? Mm, uh, let's take a look at emplacements though. Mortar at the middle, so they're gonna have to go through the mortar base. Because uh, these were correspond red, yellow, green. Uh, the yeah. yellow base in the middle here, they have to clear, um, is going to have the mortar. And down south, they got lucky. I think this is the base with the two emplacements. And then red base... Ha <laughs> Good lord. Hold on a second, guys. Copy, yeah, I like the information that the uh, fire team should be safe for now. Right, we're in good formation now. One, keep that north clear. Oddball, Lagar, Killer, you're free to push east. Okay. Uh, Doggo. Right. Let's get going. Uh, if you could just help some sort of line skin the and one of five, that'd be awesome. Well, what was that? All the... All the audio came back at once. East to Charlie. North to northeast. I'm, I'm guessing ROE is... If they shoot us, we shoot them back? Yeah, try to hold fire though until you get positive ID. Roger. Hold here for a second. It's been a few minutes. Obviously nothing's changed. The vehicles have rarely moved up in the north here. Looks like there is a squad yeah, actually forward. moving about out here because these guys now have people. Rain here. It's gonna be a long. It's gonna be. It's gonna be a. 
interesting end to the operation. Both forces will have complete numbers. Right, Frost, you're free to push past to the next village over east. Tracking I mean, This is what I was saying earlier. When they clear the yellow route, they're also basically clearing the green route. We're going to wait for the rest of the platoon to push up a little bit more. Here's, um, because the yellow route, this, this is the village for yellow route right here. The green route's first village, I believe, is this point. Keep oddballs north safe and Reggie, hold your position. Which is this village in the distance. And considering how Camdash is, uh, sort of all set up. Building clear. I'm okay with it would, it's just building. a hop, skip, and a jump away. A. B. Someone could be set up in a, because this is I the, I think the green route down here is the one that gets the HMGs. There could be an HMG realistically set up outside the base. That could have like overview, like could have overwatch onto the valley below. So they could put one maybe over here. I think they might have the range to do that. I mean, heck, they could put one on top of the roof here because they got fortifications as well. So, you know. Lots of, I mean, there's a lot of potential for these bases to have, you know, some considerable firepower and setup. Of course, it's not happening because we have to wait another 20 minutes for contact. I mean, it is what it is, guys. Uh, we're just chilling. We're going to go on the ground and follow some more guys here. Let's see who we got over here. Let's follow Frost's squad. Let's see what Frost is talking about here. Next objective is Golf 1199. And then I picked the guy that saw also talking in squad radio, not locally. Sure which makes sense because he is squad lead. They're in the trees. Yeah, basically. Fuck, dude, that'd be sick. You could set up like little sniper towers. Oh, like hell hunting outposts. No. Hell no. Like a tree stand. All right, we got friendlies up here in these buildings now, so just careful. Make sure you keep tree stand eyes. would be kind of a cool yeah, thing. I don't think I'm seeing anybody in here, to be honest. That's just me. Copy. Take a look at eyeball here, moving through. Lagar, I want you posted on that uh, height just east of the little diamond we created. Covering a frost, <laughs> should be pushing past you. It's nice. It's a comfort diamond. Comfort Diamond. Here we go. Right, Oddball, hold at the road, and uh, Killer, hold at height. We'll see what the Frost sees in that village up ahead. Moving in position now. That's a terrible spot. Yeah, that's it. It is a fucking terrible spot. We're gonna get flanked to one. Yeah. South. Looks like two has our south, and so is three. Like I said, looks... right. I'm not seeing any movement. And then Can we see that hill 120? I don't have visual on it. Question in chat, do uh, you think there will ever be an AI mod or AI development so that you can have PvE servers? We've had bots so far, right? before. Um, I'm not sure what the status of those are for the mod. You can have them like do things like on a very basic level. Not entirely sure if you can have them think on the arm level of Arma AI. I told I told Reddit to swap with you because I want him looking at the rare. instead of my name. well, my bad then. Yeah, squad four can confirm no movement in the village southeast of squad four, northeast of two. Right, uh, are you pushing? Push east. Nah, nah, it's just trailer. Also, I don't even think that's the village we're supposed to be hitting. 
now, but there's always a chance like it the might fire too many. Oh yeah, never just ignore. Never just ignore anything. All right. Let's go farther south here. We've all we've been staying up north, or or sorry, no, further north here. We've been staying pretty far south here. Let's see what these guys are doing up here. Just like our previous spot. Sounds good. Right, Five Reggie, mostly north. Take, uh, I believe the other two things position. are fucking. Killer, you've got a nice ridge up ahead. Or no, we're in the middle. Use uh, that to scout up east. Still keep your eyes north. We have a lot of uh, cover Copy. south. They're gonna get here eventually. Uh, halfway there, to contact, and we've started seeing uh, potential enemy line forming around the uh, Hotel India the line at uh, nine. Copy. You're free to move and uh, close the gap if you feel like it's uh, able. I don't like that ridge to the north of us. I advise five clears, clears that village directly east of them, then break south, so we've got a good solid line. Copy. And then uh, Raggy will take his spot and hold that ridge for us. Hi, right, brother. Start creeping down the hill. Push further east. Uh, no, we're gonna steer. Oh, never mind. The village at Golf 1075 is clear. Clearing uh, Hamlet by Hamlet here, and now we've closed to within about 600, 700 meters of contact, and there's a sp decent yeah, spread the here. Fire team size force. Copy that. Oh, look, and they have a Dishka. So the Dishka Techie North. Plus a fire team on the ridge line, India 9 7. Should I uh, do over Second fire team on that same uh, line, uh, India 11 7. With the saw? Holding Fire's all the roofs here, with second floors in this village. Bravo as they push across the road. Construction points have been spent on yellow base and also on the uh, the southern base and only one HMG has been set up and it's, <laughs> it's pointed north. Almost as if they're just like prepared for using this base to fight back with. Alright, let's push up with them. Lagar, you're taking the ridges north of the village of 12 and Frost is clearing the village itself. Sorry, can you repeat? This frost is going around. The ridges you're on right now, Lagar, you're going to hold that uh, slightly east of it around the roads, covering frost's north. Copy that. Getting close to contact. Right it's happening, I swear. It'll happen soon. One difference is that uh, we've got fire team leads. Right, let's go clear this. Wait, hold on, they're riflemen, aren't they? That's right. We don't have the mod. I would have been very bad. Nope, only on the last one. I checked. Ah, okay. I mean, they're getting a lot of practice clearing the villages. They just haven't done any uh, by taking fire yet. So you know. In there, you're gonna get Eventually, the they'll get there. Building there. It'll take a little bit, though. All right, we're closing within 500 meters now. Closest troops to contact are the group we're following, Killer J, and then uh, looks like Hazmat, Feds, Lemon Sledge, FTL. 
yeah, that's what are in the distance and the, line slightly south, one the south. eagle-eyed Good ones line. might be able to spot these guys moving of course it's going to be difficult for uk to spot ins for us we're gonna keep following this fire team here though blue jericho's got a fire team that's moving on Unless another team comes in the contact first, we'll just watch these guys. Ghost, I want you to watch that it. complex to our direct north. There's a little compound there. Just get eyes on it. Roger. Yeah, just hold your brother team. We're going to glass out a bit. They really stronghold the last thing. Probably. Yeah, probably. This is this is psych warfare right now. All right, copy that. I'll hold this position. Then. Yep, the other position is Golf Ten One Five. One Fairy Team. I think they got have one forward squad. <laughs> Most likely. I think they do. They're gonna probably hit us with an IED if they have any. No, they don't have any IEDs. They do have oh, mines okay. though. I mean, this is a pretty do strong it? line here. Yeah, I saw that on the op paper, you know, the document. <laughs> See, that that made, for me, that makes no sense since we don't have any vehicles. Yeah, I don't know. Always like to change it up too. Like, if you read it at the beginning of the week, by the end of the week, when it gets to Oh, even even the puppies realize that the op doc changes like before operations happen. Whoa! Whoa! Dude, that's awesome. Close, but then about 400 meters now. Contact in. Looks like now we've got nameless part of the squad over here with silent or part of the uh, squad four here, who's now close to contact. Uh, we're gonna hear some. Uh, we're gonna hear some. We know how that worked. Yep, <laughs> unfortunately. Or there, flanking time from our Okay, here we go. Nameless coming up over the ridge. Yeah, Airborne right. Viper and Exoskeleton are in this next village over here to the east. Now, the other thing is, now we are vanilla, everybody gets Binox. I wonder if they would... That would be an interesting Will idea they get they spotted? Will they get spotted? off the objective to just some random village? The rest of, uh, I think this is Oddball Squad, everyone's moving up. This is gonna go swimmingly. Northeast. Yep, ideally I want you up there, but only get close if you think it's clear. Now, what kind of visibility these guys have? Viper might have a chance here, but Viper's yeah. keeping a low profile. If they haven't already been spotted. The five teams into the village to a rock position. Airborne. Copy. Might have a chance to see these guys. Airborne's backed off. All over the northwest and east. Last objective. Like probably all the way east. Probably all the way east. Yeah. All right, buddy team, clear right. this building out. It's gonna be kind of difficult here. We're gonna be moving up. Oh no, down here, Sam the guy, uh, Sam the that could running up to a position on top of the hill. Does he see Hazmat? No, he's not looking up the hill. Does he see him now? Does he see him now? Hazmat is holding fire, and there we go. One dead, and it's Sam first. Copy, Jim. On that ridge, then you're going to go to. Copy, you're Raggy. Do you have eyes on that ridge? Wreck is stuck. Not right now, no. Right, keep a fire team uh, on that ridge with you, but send your fire team south, straight east. And I think we have some shots down here to the south as well. Or, no? Nah. Yeah, we got some shots. Yeah, really fucking close. Here's 
Clicker's dead. He gets shut out good. by Viper. I'm gonna need that top floor. I'm gonna need that top floor. Bad grenade. Oh no, that was an enemy grenade. They both have to bandage. Is Gimli gonna YOLO this thing and take a chance here? Viper's still got a great position here. Shots ringing out. That was a rough nade. That was a rough nade, at least we didn't die. Go ahead. I got my two FTLs spread. One with old, uh, old ball and one with... Uh, He's right here, I hear so him. To provide support. Biscuit, here's Gimli running around the bottom floor. And Viper is getting uh, BTFO'd from his window. INS is just maneuvering here. Biscuit misses a chance to get Lewis. Lewis turns around and does it to him hard. And Nameless eventually puts a bullet into a uh, guy on the bottom there. Uh, I forget his name. I'm so dumb. Nameless still bleeding. Gets a second one. We got a TK over there in the, in the north. Multiple INS casualties. Piper puts ends nameless there. More casualties happening. Uh, it's starting to rack up here. It's still pretty even. Five, four kills to five for INS. Wreck is still alive. That's pretty good considering he's right next to a dude that got dropped. Yep, take hill, guys. Take hill. Right here. Watch We got one dead body. Okay. Now it looks like north, north reloading. East. Well, I mean, the British are redeploying the, one of the squads here. It looks like they lost an SL. Wait, they didn't lose an SL. The SL has just left them behind. What are these guys doing here? Ines, uh. Uh, Biscuit goes down. And Silas is just here in the village over here down south. Silas can do some damage here. But uh, he's going to have to find someone to shoot first. British AR fire is trying to help suppress. And of course, also down further south here, we've got contact. British gone through the INS lines. INS are in buildings, so British just walking past, not clearing them effectively. They're, they're outside the building. Evan's got an enemy up top, uh, on top of him. Right, this building? building. He's gonna try to go up the stairs. I think Saber just killed himself. Well, I don't know. They're gonna try and throw a frag upstairs, right, I think. I think he's on the balcony. I think he's on the balcony. Balcony, balcony. Don't let him get trapped. Give him space. Give him space. Gotta be trapped. Gotta be trapped. I'm gonna go. 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 Ready? Nice clear. Hovis, one of the squad leads here, just opening up on our people on the on the building. There's a enemy lodgy heading that way. They're to the north of us. Oh, then Raggy, keep them where they are. They're gonna have contacts. They may try to circle around. Oh, damn. Those enemy contacts are in Hotel 834. Hey, what? More mortars coming out. Right, then maybe you want to, you can push them there. I don't want to have them be bored, honestly. Push them to the contacts uh, Killer has. Yeah, no, so so right. there is a, uh... Right, right, right. Squad three contacts are due north in the building. Be careful. If Dishka is opening up on some of these guys. Post here may have seen wreck and Rex just hiding behind a rock the HMG doesn't have an eye on though so it's fine uh, meanwhile down south here force still in contact mortars are landing beyond British troops I think I heard one out of my right ear there airborne and Olek are just chilling in the village here they are assuming someone's coming to kill them very soon Oh, like running around the bottom floor here, now going upstairs. 
Hey, he's not dead. Yep. Further south we yeah, go, and Ines have pretty much wrote off, have written off a squad here. They've actually moved past Hovis. I was trying to communicate on the horn that uh, they run around him. Lancer, if he remains more patient, he's got a chance to get some kills here. Nope, someone saw him. I think Uptown saw him. Yeah, look at that. He's deployed. Yeah, they see him. They know he's up there. That's 29. Yes, 220. That enemy attacking pull to our north is moving. Scope is getting shot at. Ooh! Which direction? Rounds are landing right above. These guys are just hiding out. Uh, Kazli's right now is still even 11 kills for British. British up by one to 10 for INS. Mortars are also landing. Still not on target. Assaulting fire team here on this middle village. Talking just now has uh, Lewis left. Silas also in the village here. Talking's gonna try to clear, and I think this is the best chance Lewis might have. Oh, and he gets him. I don't believe so. Talking uh, jumps the window, not checking first. And Silas, violence of action, takes a bullet, but ends Lewis. Well, uh, they would use GLs, I would imagine, if they had GLs. They do not have GLs. It's basically in a rifleman's operation. Uh, the most sophisticated weapon that exists here, I believe, is the uh, Dishka, maybe the Mortar. Uh, no GLs for either side here. INS are basically using AKs and RPKs taking shots from the south side. and the dishka they also have one mortar operating out of this middle base here uh there was a patrol route that uh, british were taking and they've gone up the middle and the last point of these patrols Mortars incoming. is where all the uh all the training camps are so speaking in terms of pure objectives the uh the brits need to take out kilo 10 4 and then they proceed to their exfil point lima a5 Minus one Dishka for INS forces. Second one is still working. Mortars are footing on you. I guess that happens. Summer's now running too. Hovis still living here uh, in this building with uh, his buddy, rather Scottish chap. Oh, it's just right. taking his time. He's not alone here. He's still got scope. Summer's just got pinged, I think. Why did that come out of nowhere? Uh, it's still Buxo and One Pump here on the east side of the village. Right, you're gonna have to repeat that, please. What's your situation? Oh, they're moving. Summers. Be aware, it gets shot up. Fire. 
There goes Summers. Tried to pie the uh, stairwell there. Not happening. Isn't doing well. Uh, Lagarde gets at least the fire team looking sad. Doesn't look good. So INS winning the engagement in the south. It's just Blaze stuck down here. Evan SMA. Uh, is here and is taking a elevated position, but um. Command, be advised. Uh, we were not able to steal the uh, the technical. We lost our medic in the process. We are falling back south to rejoin the rest of the platoon. They might move through this uh, right, position here, which means they're down. definitely gonna. If they come through this direction, they're definitely gonna have that problem. Uh, six, which is the command, and three here. Doing pretty well. Uh, leftovers of one or one of the fire teams for one. I think this is the base of fire element that was helping this middle push here. They're still up. INS uh, pretty content to uh, hold the north in the uh, middle here. April, how is contact map? 21 kills for INS. Brits on 17. We lost the man comes through them. Um, and I didn't get many Who call that contact? 106. Oh, one pump. I would just and Buxo. 106, 106. Uptown calls them out. About 100, shots. 100 meters. Are up to the north. Copy. And Buxo looks like he's going to bleed out. Bye bye. Oh no, he's still alive, and he bandaged, literally on less than five health. No stamina. The man is running as fast as he can. You can tell. <laughs> he's not going to have any stamina until he gets touched by a medic. Mortars did come out here for INS, and they're splashing north. Oh, Wreck takes a mortar directly to the face. Yeah, I'm falling back. Killer J pulls a fire team out of there. Killer, if you can regroup with my squad. Uh, we do need a medic on my pause. Our medic is down and I got two wounded. Right, here's the plan. Uh, More mortars. Killer, you can bring your squad to the village I'm in right now. Alpha, you're gonna rendezvous there, and then it's not. Rendezvous. It's not quite like him. We, we we just run things. Uh, we run things like a big community. There's a calendar we have. Check our website out, squadops.gg. Great. If you're interested in participating, you need to take a basic SOTT course. And guess what? There's still slots for today's course available. Could be wrong. All you need is squad for right now. Mortars landing on the hillside. Down. I'm gonna wait until killer and offer in position. I'm gonna push east, but Alpha's still a good 500 meters away from the rest of his rest of the platoon. And even though INS have lost a uh, vehicle, they still have one, and they do have the lead. They got a they got a five or sorry a six uh, six kill lead right now. Yeah, all the uh, times on the website are listed in your current time zone. I believe the basic will start, uh, what, 1730 Eastern today? I think that's the scheduled start time. Basic takes about an hour and a half tops. Usually gets done faster than that. Oh, Legar was talking. Hold on, let's go find where Legar. Legar talking dead. to command. Right, give me the remnants of squad two. I'm gonna scout it out. How many in squad two of you? Uh, they are spread. One is on the south. Oh, okay, so that's okay. Guy. Give me two of your guys. Give me yeah, two yeah. of you guys. Copy. Hour and a half. 
Uh, I mean, that's a that's an unofficial start time. That's a, I guess it's official start time. It's really supposed to be like after the operation, before tonight's operation. So, yeah, it's pretty much what we're going for. Britt's taking the time to breathe here. Um, yep. Alpha going to be uh, linking up with five. And, uh, now, all indications that there's no one over here. There's got to be some people over here, though, right? No. Nobody guarding the south. So all of Ines's forces are concentrated pretty much in the north. Katala just rolling around here. I swear it looked like he rolled that, um, that, uh, dish Kateki. I could be wrong. Prove me wrong, guy. Uh,. Well, I will say, Holofu, there's, uh... Most of the events are gonna be largely situated for a, uh... a, a U.S. time zone. Whoa! Dude, came out of nowhere. Where'd you come out of? Nowhere. Uh, we've had other time basics in the past. If you get enough people that are interested to do a basic at another time, there's a destructor available. I mean, it's possible. I would uh, I would take a look at the Sot Help channel and see if those guys have anything to say about a, a, a uh, irregularly timed, scheduled... Yeah, basic so. course position you guys push east with alpha the north killer the center and lego the south copy copy and ethel setting the plan in motion thank you buddy yeah, anybody else for medic we do have Europeans play with us, obviously. You can hear them. Um, but we are running a uh, East Coast. We are running the East Coast server. Yes, games are only YouTube chatter today I'll saying you hoorah. Right now you're pushing up, Galley. All right, my, uh, my squad's ready. I think we're good to push. Raj. <laughs> Me and Greg. All right, so right. let's reset the situation here. Dishkateki has moved back, and it looks like they're anticipating the British moving through. So this is just a uh, above. This is an elevated pin position, I guess. A suppressing position. Uh, INS have pushed out a fire team size force beyond their bases. Uh, keeping ammo? one squad around the north, hey, one squad you middle, you plus you command, and a fire team has been it, were able to fall back. Buxo and one pump survived being shot at around Julian 11 1, and they fell all the way back to the south village. There's a Dishka, uh, Dishka uh, position over here, too, so you never know. Uh, oh, guess what? Dash beyond the mortars, and he's pointed directly at five. <laughs> Let's watch the potential car uh, carnage. Final objective is Kilo 1019. Little fast, little far. Looks like about 70 meters beyond the infantry. The infantry have started moving west now, or, or starting moving east now. Those mortars are a bit closer, but the British are starting to move. If Dashby really wants to do anything, he's got to guess closer. Although there is an elevated position. Who's shooting? Sorry, this is causing problems for me. I guess they see Scope Sergeant? I have at least two contacts in that same building. One's a oh, squad leader, they one's spotted a Hovis. Um, Oh, Uptown, HMG, or Uptown with the uh, saw. 
Oh, they're suppressing. I guess. All right now. I guess they saw Scottish run out. We join fire. I'm gonna do it as well. Hey, Ethel. Command is here. I do. I do. I do. Pull back and covering. All right. And we've got some contact in the north here. Looks like that squad on the hill. Uh, British forces try to run up it. Appa's been shot as they try to take the hill here. Blaze assault on Appa on this front line. Cartel's been you know, taking uh, some frag. And, oh, a double kill! Blaze and Appa both eat a frag. More frags coming down. That was definitely another casualty I heard. INS frag rush. Anto Bill. Also bleeding. Hanu threw a frag up and he got Cartel. Another frag goes up and JV's dead. Lots of trading going on here. Skrevsky is the only one left on the hill. Feds has basically stepped off the side of it. He's going to try to run around the other side there. Hanu and Antipil stabilize themselves. Antipil's a medic. He gives himself back to 100% health. Uh, Feds uh, comes back up. Hanu is going to be like, mm, yeah, maybe not. Is Feds a medic? I think Feds is a medic. He's trying to work towards Skrevsky here. Mortars are still landing, but they're kind of beyond. Uh, but Alpha Guido is going to lead a charge straight into the middle village. Close to within 150 meters and moving. He's leading from the front. Can you get eyes on those mortars? I'm um, trying to. Careful the village, though. They're going to grab people with yeah, guns a lot of looking for this. Oh, yeah, I got people in the, one of the buildings out there. They don't see me, though. Alpha's looking, and he said he spotted someone. Could have been Crazy Mike. A bit more, try to keep as much cover as we can between yeah, us. Yeah, it was probably Crazy Mike. He's just standing in the window, still looking like a... Keep pushing like our photo looking away. like a Crazy Mike. Hey, he's a Crazy Mike. I'm going to stop that now. Dash beyond the mortar. You can see the outline. For some reason, it works. OWI, please hey, fix. Greg, you see two story closest to us. We're gonna push to that. All right. You're gonna take point. I'll be right yeah, behind you. You're gonna leap through that first floor window immediately. Again, I'll be right behind. There are three right INS there. people in okay. that building. Yeah, right. Silence, looking through. Yep. Does he see? All right. So peek around. You'll see it. The two story. Hey, one, you'll see the one window. Second, one second floor. One second floor. Of that building. Copy. Yep. Greg yep. Pants saw silent. Left side on that window. Silent did not return. By, did not uh, shoot at Greg. Still go into there. We can nade. Get uh, close and maybe nade window. He's peeking. Now right Fulcrum's now. peeking it. Yeah, if he peeks again, I'm gonna get him. Alpha I I missed. Him. Go. He's gonna. He's gonna. His head's definitely down. Let's go. Bottom floor. Alpha shot twice and missed. Bottom floor. Oh no! He's Same seen window. things. He sees right, the bush pooping yeah, through the right wall. The Keep watching. I'm gonna frag second floor. If Alpha gets this frag, this is big news. He does! Silent tries to get out. And he does, but Fulcrum dies in the second floor. Second grenade coming in? Mortars are coming in close by Dashby. And that could cause problems for the rest of his guys trying to catch up. Greg is bleeding. Alright, let's go. I heard a guy die up there, so we got one. I'm right behind you. Greg is still bleeding. He's going in. Dashby also comes in, and uh, he gets shot in the back as he tries to go up the stairs. Silent. Fucking damn it. Yeah. Yo. Yeah. Dashby's gonna run away to the north, uh, what northeast. Friendly coming in. Alpha's gonna okay. rearm. Second floor. I'm gonna try to go outside and throw another frag up there. Watch out. All right. Which corner was he? Fragging, fragging second floor. Yeah. Frank right, goes in, but Silence here. outside. And Silence just comes right back right, in. Right. He went right. He went back in. Oh, Alpha has the bandage here. Uh, British yep. really right, full, fully it. realizing this assault here. We're going to go over to Feds, who's in an awkward spot. Push everything you have east. He puts a bullet in the ghost question mark? I think he did. Oh, a grenade. This could be good. He throws towards Hamadi, but it might have bounced off. 
Oh, actually, he threw a ghost and ghost ate it. I misread the model. Ines now bringing in another squad for backup. They pulled the squad off the south. The northern base has a fire team plus size element coming down. They're about ready to close from fives back. Feds eats a grenade in the meanwhile. Big rip. Seth in the chat if you think Feds could have lived. It's still INS uh, decided here. 31 kills. The British is 34, or 24 rather. Alpha's still alive here. Uh, Silent is still holding the stair, and uh, there's the trade. The pre fire around the stairwell, and knowing Silent was definitely going to hear him move towards the stairwell. That's about, I mean, short of Silent living in Europe, uh, I'm pretty sure there's another way that's really going to go. Meanwhile, Nightmare's dead over here. We go further south. Fluff McGruffs and uh, Salty Toast. No Living out. life on this southern yeah, flank. Sorry, oh, hey, guess what? Yeah. There's a Dishka. And Phil got Phil Nye is looking through the Dishka. He's mounted up. They have no idea he's here. Now, Phil doesn't have optics. All right, how far was he? Like 10 meters? Kalata. I didn't see him. He, he was literally right in front of me about five. In before wow. Salty gets his head taken off here. No it's definitely a clear line of sight. Lots of fire still going north here. But I don't I think that's just suppressive fire. It feels looking around. And more casualties as the ambush starts to become an effect. Squad two from oh, behind. They, they probably don't know where that shot came from. As Dude, soon as they no longer have contact south, bring them in. Uh, I messed up. Oh no, the Southie, or Fluffs got hit. Oh, that was because uh, Kutiwo. Okay, Fluffs pull back. There was an INS guy just walked up on, on him. It. I kind of got tagged a good bunch. Thank God he was using the SKS. Buxo is over here. Still living, and the Dishka is now firing back. Salty Toast with an AR. Take, take slower shots. I just want to suppress him. Because I can't actually see him. See him. Copy. Right now, objective is to clear the buildings west of the road and see what we can do to reach the east side. There is missing it. Oh, Phil actually gets hit there, and he's off the Dishka. More rounds being fired around the village. Yeah. He got oh. out. Hey, is that ammo back? Headbusters oh. got a fire team size element. Uh, they came know. from the northern base and they're just still chilling. He's got 45 Pop ammo. Town. Yeah, get over here. See that little ammo symbol? Get to it. Run over. INS held up in the east side of the village. Dash B, Sven, and Crazy Mike. Point. That is correct. Hey, Toasty, I'm coming to you. Right to the point point is not first. Yep, copy. I'm not sure what he is. Yeah, he's right on the ridge, 50 meters to our southwest. Right, like our sit rep on the south, are they still there? Yeah, they're looking. Yeah, they still got on the south like enemies and the southwest right now, they are pulling back. Right, go down here. Well, that's cool. Oh, look, the guys to the south are from coming in from behind. Uh, we need to find a way to clear the building. Scope Sergeant Hovis, and I rather this guy's chap. Hopus eats a bit of that Let grenade. Southwest, through thirty. Yeah, he, he's further southwest from that. That nade just went. Hearing a vehicle move around. Phil Nye is repositioning the Dishka. There's no way we can with that nade. He's gonna be up there. It's probably two of them too. Does I wonder what Red is thinking? Shots ringing out. Oh, it was a TK! The grenade! If you want to Scope why, eats it, and Hovis goes down with them. They're trying to even it up. British still on 28. INS up to 33 kills now. Oh, yeah. 
Sven is looking for a clean shot on Helmody or Killer here, maybe. Could be looking as far left as Toasty, but he's taking shots. I think he saw Killer. Not really happening. More suppression coming out for British forces. Guess what? INS is starting to come in from the rear. Reloading. And I believe Uptown is not long for this world. Guns dry. Wait, is Lagar and Aethel still back here? Oh, okay, so maybe they, they might have a chance here. That's okay, that's okay. Just hold their head. Now, Imanaz has made out Stand some pro tremendous way. progress, but he's pushing a bit further south, and he's not looking this direction. Shadow Knight. Also, it looks like the INS are bypassing. Lagar, I think, saw Shadow Knight. He switched his rifles. He switched his rifle. He's taking a shot at Shadow Knight. And he's whiffing. And he whiffed. Crazy Mike actually has a killer angle here, guys. Look at that angle. And he's causing problems for the toasty for toasting uptown as they live as they're living behind this building oh, on the other side of that uh uh gas can barrel. Yep. Here you are. What the hell is my problem? Of course it's a barrel. Uh, myself, the guy. Copy. Uh, Copy. So the radar, the uh, the base still exists. The objective is yeah. this fob radio, and after that they proceed to the end. Right, so you good? Let's go. INS have redeployed their entire I'm troop, and yeah, they are now pincering. Uh, stay yeah, I've got three mags. Sorry. They're set up for a pincer uh, maneuver, or sort of. Uh, I don't know where it's. Legar is still looking around here. British suppression coming out, and they're trying to make a uh, progress here. Crazy Mike gets hit. Katala and Revy are along with Reloading. Fisco, Reloading. reinforcing the base from the east. Dashby is still living in the back here as well. Six INS now in the village. Unless I can't count. Copy. There's five INS in the village now. Still trying to keep tabs on what's going on back here. Oh, there's more than that. Katal Kalata gets Reload. zinged out of a window here. Oh, look at that! They forgot to unload the mortar. Aethel is sending rounds straight up, question mark. Always oh, put smokes in there. All your smokes out east. All of your smokes. Neg uh, negative toast. I was shooting over here. Apologize. And here comes all the smokes. We're all seeing smoke mortar is going to land here very shortly. Copy. Ooh. I think Revy got a bit of that uh, mortar there. Rich throwing all their smokes. They have to get this radio. Everyone else, cross when the smoke is up. And here we go. It busted too far away, Meepso, and there are some more INS south, but they're not going to be able to stop this assault unless they have elevation and a clean line of sight. Two ARs covering command with three riflemen, four riflemen. They move it across the road simultaneously. Now Crazy Mike's in this building. Crazy Mike gets hit. He goes down. Matt Elias also eats it. And Toasty comes in to clear the building. He scared the shit out of me. <laughs> right behind you, like, hey, can you go for uh, I have no ammo. ammo. Brits are right, looking for the radio. Just the radio is on the like second floor. Nobody else in this building. This building's clear. Building clear, I have the radio. I'm gonna check this. Technical victory take from Brits yeah, incoming. Clear. They still have to make it I out alive, down. though. And looks like Dashby's realized, oh, they have the radio building now. 
Of course, you knew that already. Alright, shove it, shove it, shove it. Up there. Sorry. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Yep, there you go. They're trying, to, they're trying to grenade inside the building. Grenades are coming through. Dashby looking for a way to that, uh, stop right them from they're, digging the... Great, right. Really um, Dashby, the building, INS commander. Sure Here it comes. Kills <laughs> Ethel. Those shoots like out of the back. Downstairs, downstairs. Ah! Down. Killer J trades. Covering you. With Dashby, what a play from Dashby. Here comes Fisco. Fisco's gonna take his time coming up the stairs here. And Fisco gets backed off by Toasty. I'm bleeding, I'm brandaging. Fisco eats it. Amadi needs to keep taking that radio down. Uptown makes it across, but now he's being surrounded by the south. I, I'm and about a squad-sized force coming in from the south. All right, I'm good. Ah, and Toasty eats it. Because Remy comes in. Hamodi's still stuck behind the radio. He has to jump. He has to mount. Pistol VAK. Pistol wins! Comedy with a freaking pistol. I'm with you it, down. Roger. Uptown's still up. I'm bleeding out bad. Uptown currently not bleeding. Uh, am I able to heal your bleeding? And the medic will tell him this. No, I can't. This is Godfather to Command Net. Is there anybody in the chain of command that's currently active? Yeah, I just need the medic bag, and we, I don't think we have that. There's a medic south, COC? but we're stretched too thin. You, where are they exactly? Are they just no. to us? I think Ethel was the last one. Uh, I believe so. I killed one within like 50 feet of us to the southeast. Three Brits remain, and Hamadi is getting back on the objective. Wait. Redibus and Fluffs are still here? What are these guys doing? Even that it went quiet, I can't hear them. Will do. I'm, I'm just writing something up, Alpha. I'm already going back to digging the radio. I mean, these guys have to know the radio is being dug. Hmm? Over this guy. I know they're retreating to the south. Yep. That doesn't make sense. I caught the tail end of its scope. What happened? Did you drop a grenade? I, I'm watching north, northeast. I'm watching direct east. Hey guys, medics here. Assuming only uh, one guy needs you. Oh, okay, here we go. Yeah, Changing right, the ROE. Guys, what, Ines are, are gonna have to assault the point. Kilo 10, one niner. South? I believe I stopped, me and Redibus stopped their assault. I think they're shifting east to come in on the east through the trees. You think they're going to come through the east? Is that what you said? Yeah, because what happened is they tried to push in the south. Me and Retribus fucking opened up on them. I know I got at least one confirmed kill. And then while I was up there, before you called me down here, I did see them shifting east along that south ridge line across the road. Oh, Fisco. Okay, Roger. That's rough, I'm bud. Go get Dumb question. With, uh, hey, you got round two there. coming. Though, Dumb question. So... Does anybody have any extra ammo? No, I don't think so. Unless we got an FTL here. Coming in with you. You want me to set up in this window with my AR? Do what you I'll can. Be on the 
Uh, Hamadi doesn't have a mic. That's, uh... That's disappointing. How much you got left in the AR? Red was just chilling by himself here. Oh, and look, INS are just gonna waltz east and then attack east to west. Exactly like Fluffs thinks is gonna happen. Cool. Okay. So who's actually running Imanaz? Is he running too? Are these guys all in two? Okay, Scott is just not in two. Okay, so <clears throat> might not be that bad. Uh, let's six INS versus five British. Redibus is outside the base, and four of them are defending well, we're on that the, the patrol the point block really proper. Plopper. Proper. Proper. And so we are waiting for INS to feel comfortable and slip in here. Oh, maybe I'm getting you confused. They don't have to assault the start point. Okay, so that is a confusion point. So they're actually gonna hold out here. The British are gonna hold the last patrol point as an Alamo. I had gotten confused. The original op, I think the old op Maybe it was never this way, but I, th I, I, for some reason, I always thought they did the three points and then they went to the opposite start location, but that wouldn't make sense. Because if they went uh, east to west, they waltz into Maine, they get fire protection. So that doesn't make sense. Uh, let's see here, uh, they're getting closer. Oh, look at Dishka. So a fire team size force and a buddy team up north Redibus, the only one. He doesn't see the Dishka. Ines making moves close to within 100 meters of Redibus. If Redibus gets the first strike here, there's a good chance INS might flounder a bit here in the south. More people here in the south. Where are these guys going? Good to know. And here comes the uh, intelligence gathering from the remaining remaining uh, INS forces. They're not looking Redibus's way. Redibus still a bit low to the ground here. Might not have a chance to see these guys. Even though it's pushing out strong. It's going straight in for it. Because there's a bit of a shelf here and he can get a little bit of cover. Redibus is looking around, doesn't see anything, and he's moving away. And INS have reoccupied the Dishkateki. They're going to have to wait until the last minute to bring that thing out because it's going to pretty much telegraph which direction they're focusing on. INS online, and here comes the techie. It started moving. No windows facing this direction. Oh, my, oh, excuse me, there's two. And they aren't using them. Jim has eyes. Redibus is engaged. Maybe it was not Redibus. I think it was Uptown putting some bullets at Imanaz's way. To Modi. I just saw one 
very close. 98. Let's see what Jam can do here. Oh, Hamodi goes down. All right, guys, get sharp angles on stairs. Ooh, that's a pretty sick little angle right there. I would never expect him. Jam pistoling this guy. He got a hit. Even though I was a bit too far away. <laughs> Even though I was on instinct, goes to his bandage. He's not bleeding. <laughs> Not bleeding from being hit by the pistol. Buxo gets off, and uh, I guess uh, I guess Redibus did fire at him at one point. Buxo's looking for him. Buxo might have Redibus' number. Redibus decides to get up here, or not. Redibus takes out Buxo. Uh, three. Yeah, it looks like three. Someone died over here. Three INS making the assault, two on the objective for Brits. This is a defense situation for British. And they still have Scottish and one pump holding the rear. They're trying to find Redibus. A bit too far for a real eye on uh, engagement here. Redibus is scanning for any sort of movement, and I think he's going to see Scottish, but uh, Redibus also kind of getting worried here. He's going to reload his his uh, mini-me. Oh, wait. Wait, what? They have optics? Well, That's there you go, building. gents. It's probably the only time you're going to see optics used in an operation for squad ops. Two outside my building. Copy. Medics on British. Range. For some reason, only just, just ACOGs. Yeah, yeah. So Jam is holding in position. Fluffs is holding on the objective in position, holding the stair. Grenade coming in. Oh, And more people talking after death, more people about to lose their basic tags. Imanaz and Shadow Knight. Uh, Shadow Knight eating part of his own frag there. Get Susat and ACOG? Well, if the Susat wasn't broken, maybe. They're all over me, man. Get ready. Pretty sure that's the ACOG. They know I'm up here, so you might be able to pick the belt if you want to get both. Oh, look at that! Jam gets they one! I'm in here, I was getting shot at. Then just stay low. Right of us is down, it's just us two. Yep. Just stay down, get a cheeky angle. Oh, Imanas killed Redibus from here, guys. Look at that shot. Wait, Imanas taking the stairs. He wants in. Fluffs loses the trade! Even us on the objective. Hello, everyone. And Jam's here by himself, about to talk to the stream and everyone else watching in the server. Even us on the building. And I think it's just Jam with a pistol. Uh, one pump over there is Scottish, so it's 3v1. Even though it's on the objective, I think we're going to see a, uh... I think we're going to see an order for British to retake this building. And then round one will be done. Normally we'll be starting round two right now, right? Yeah, it's, it's like 420. It's past 420. Uh, we started around 3 o'clock. <laughs> It's an hour and a half since we've been live. Uh, we've only been for one round. You know, like you do. Round two coming up after this. I'm going to take a break. I don't know. Uh, ooh, is one pump going to throw a grenade up there? And uh, I think Jam's going to eat this. Oh, he gets out, but he's made himself completely exposed. 
Here we go. Imanaz gonna end it. Thank goodness. Imanaz does it. Throw 45 kills for Inesta. 40 for Brits. And that is round one in the bag. Woo! Guys, that, that took forever. <laughs> Uh, whew. uh, we've got round one in the bag, round two coming up very soon. Thank you guys for watching on B Car and uh, bear with us as uh, you know, we do the next thing. Jack, why get off the rock? I just want to be associated with these idiots. Thanks. Half of them are probably smarter than you. Oh! I want to bet on it. Okay, so here's the plan. We're going to take the red route, which is the northernmost mount route. That's the three fall markers. In the far north, we're going to have Head Busta following the helmet marks. He's going to keep our northern, basically our flanking and maneuvering in the north. Making sure none of them try and wrap around us from that direction. South of him, we're going to have Revy, marked by the Marks and Marks. He's going to be one of the two primary assault squads. He'll basically be going from point to point, position to position, taking the objectives. South of him, we will have Hovis, basically doing the parallels Revy, but from the south, following the lot marks, going to the point, and then going to the next one. Those two are going to be working in tandem as our primary assault teams. Finally, in the south, we'll have Cartel. He'll be more or less doing what Hovis is doing. South, he will be following the hot marks, providing a southern screen, making sure anyone that spawns, or any INS that might be south of us, don't come up from the south and flank us. And then Sven's going to be in the middle and the rear, basically reinforcing either the assault team or Cartel or whoever needs it, when, when and where we need it. Um, final objective is going to be that last fall point. Once we get there, we get the radio down, and then we defend the radio. If we're quick about it, we can get supplies and a mortar. Um, they have a mortar too, so you, you can hijack their mortars and HMGs if you get the chance. So don't be afraid to use that against them or just waste their ammo. Pretty simple. Everyone's basically going to follow their own lines, but I'm sure it'll all go to, go to a mess. But yeah. Any questions? You all comfy? Blue Monk, what you doing, buddy? What you? It's like over there. Yeah. It's okay. We all good? Everyone's comfy? Yep. No concerns? Yep. Everyone Forget. has B minus blood. I'm concerned about that. <laughs> it's no, I'm all negative. So we're all good medics. We can interchange blood. All right, That's let's get life. Good luck. That's not how that works. He knows that. Imagine they assign your platoon based on your blood. We'll be going off the west side, east side of the point. That just sounds like a space marine chapter. I mean, it's efficient, right? You don't have to send each platoon individual, like, like different types of. We were like, yeah, we'll get you some. But what's because... she wearing a mask? Interesting. She didn't come to my house. It's a and she and... didn't change color. Uh, it's um, you know. <laughs> it's the new world. The, the Girl Scouts start using drones to send the cookies. <laughs> I paid for my Girl Scout cookies and they got them, I got them shipped. Which is different than this one. I had to that's order four boxes though. Yeah, that's what I did. That's what we did too. I should have bought more. Real talk, those, uh, what is it? Toffee-tastic? The gluten-free cookies? Yeah. I should have bought more than one box of those. Yeah. No, they're good though. The coconut ones and the regular ones. Yeah, I agree. I like, they're I they're like... For, uh, I paid for the... Go ahead. I paid for the Boy Scouts to come over and set ones. up my grill, my fire pit, my tent. Dude, dude, Listen, to yeah, I went Frozen Samoas like, only yeah, here. I'm frozen Thin there. Mints what only here. <laughs> oh, Frozen Thin Mints, Jesus <laughs> Lord. Oh, I got a yeah, box so in my freezer hide. right now. You have to hide the Samoas from me. Those things. Yeah, same here. No, but listen, I went through them so quick. Listen, some ginger snaps and a cup of milk, alright? That's all you need. Some Switzels. Mm. I mean, sure. That's important. <laughs> Switzels? Wait, what are Switzels? Are those the ginger snaps? Yeah, schnitzel. it's the company. I, I don't oh. know what it is. Yeah. Uh, okay, whatever. It's, it's not schnitzel. What about, uh, what about Veil Wafers? Those are pretty good. 
Oh, dude. You get oh. the fuck out. <laughs> dude, you put some, you put some, you put some, you put some icing on it. Hey, it's not like I said oatmeal raisins better than chocolate. Hey, shit. cartel, make lemon sludge point. I am point. <laughs> All right, well, send him to the back then. Okay, no, we're cool. Just I'm not talking. Every, everyone's on the point. Squad on line. line. No, no, Stone Oleg has in real Well, we'll just let him get a little further ahead of everybody else. Yeah. Alright, look, guys, it's not like I said sweet popcorn's better than <laughs> butter popcorn. Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> You're gonna sit sweet on top of the mountain. Alright, guys, good luck. Have a bye. Finally. Let's move. Finally. Round two finally begins, and the Brits are moving away. Mistake never ordering enough cookies. Well, I mean, I usually don't. If I'm honest with you, Girl Scout cookies, like... Hold on. The box of Toppy Tasty cost me like four and a half bucks, right? It's only... It's not even seven ounces worth of cookies. So... It's a fundraiser. Yeah, I get it. But I mean, let's get real here. Um... I'm just in it for the cookie every once in a while, right? But it's a fundraiser thing too, so you know, it's fine. Speaking of fundraisers, guys, uh, all donations made to Squad Ops this month go to uh, the Stack Up initiative that's happening. And uh, we have a special channel in our Discord that uh, lists everyone's Stack Up donation. As of today, we've raised Oh, sorry, as of yes, uh, no, as of today, we've raised uh, over $670. Over $675 raised for Stack Up this month. So if you're interested in making a donation and associating it with Squad Ops, squadops.gg slash donate, every single donation goes straight to the Stack Up, uh, Stack Up charity. Uh, Stack Up, if you're not familiar, it's a uh, it's a nonprofit for a nonprofit charity uh, that uh, helps veterans out. Um, it's a lot of you know veteran issues, especially like uh, post service issues, um, fighting or start, not fighting against, but sort of helping soldiers, helping veterans cope with PTSD, uh, get treatment for that um, to stop uh, veteran suicide. And, um, uh, <clears throat> excuse me, hold on. Uh, there's a problem. Someone's getting shot. Um, so it looks like Squad 2 is taking contact to their front, and there's already been a casually, maybe, uh, the Dishka guy has gone off. We can see Blaze Assault has been hit, and he's stabilizing with the medic right now. Good for him. No deaths yet, but, um,. Are you still there? Oh, yeah, that still is a there. great uh, that's a great start here for British Dark, able to uh, able to right stop the Dishka from causing problems and Probably if you don't have, have abandoned the first Dishka the line is looking pretty strong here for British though I like it I think it's pretty good not gonna lie I've got contact at Charlie 897 in front of you, Squad 2. Hovis, if you can, I really need you to get across that road. So, Hovis from the south is spotted. Transferring people there. 97? Charlie 89. Okay, so this great reference is a little off. But Revy is going to be basically pushing west, uh, east here. There's only two squads here. There's a squad in the south. Are they getting off this area? Yes, they are. They're abandoning the southern base. Probably the last two squads going to be living here. They're probably starting to move northeast now, or northwest now. Four has abandoned the southern training camp. British are trying to establish the northern flank for their line. And, um, you know, it's looking pretty good. Brits pretty strong here. The straight out of the gate contact is what I prefer, but I mean, it is, it's one of them things. Forward. Let's keep moving. Forward as best we can, one and two. 
Brits uh, with the uh, AR support at range here. Hovis' squad adding AR fire. Hovis Very talking nice. Lancer directly on the target here. Yeah, yeah. And I even think from this position, yeah. Disa the report is disabled. Oh yeah, look at that. It's gone. MMGs, guys. MMG against zero armor techies is pretty good. And um, Revy squad starting to make that way up the, where they're way up the hill. Careful over here, guys. Oh light. wait, I can't see. What? Why can't I see? <sighs> I can't see INS kills right now. Hold on. There we go. Zero. All right. Can I get back to Cam? Okay. Can I see kills now? I cannot. For some reason, I have been screwed over. So we won't know. <laughs> we won't know how uh, the uh, INS are doing. So, uh... I guess we're going to be playing with a little bit less information than usual. Here we go. Squad 4 is starting to take contact. Uh, squad 3, Cartel has hit Lagar. Uh, it's actually Echo 6. Lemon Echo Sledge, Echo. not actually on point. I'm disappointed. JV is uh, skylighting himself pretty bad here. Uh, everyone just say goodbye to JV. He's going to get shot here. He's running straight at digit. Uh, Fluffs McGruff, Salty Toast, got to see this. Shots ring out. Digit actually shooting past JV. I don't think he saw him. But there are shots at the skylining British troops here. And JV's stuck. He hides behind a tree. <laughs> oh, Lord. Skeleton gets one tapped. Do not pass go. Do not collect $200. Straight to the spectator screen. And mortars are coming out. Just keep them there. Two and five, your main priority is actually to the east. One and four, you got the objective. What a shot, though. Mortars are coming out, so I wonder where they're going to land. Oh, they're going towards Cartel Squad. Mike got hit by that mortar. Just a couple of shells, and they're on target. The spread at that range is going to be pretty strong. JV's kind of stuck, though. Let's be real. Hovis has eyes on the town, and he's trying to update everyone. The uh, the level of contact in town is relatively weak. The problem is... Seven building. Excuse me. The problem is uh, Lagar has really got uh, Squad 3's number down here in the south. There's a lot more shots going up north, but Digit and Redibus have swung out, and Cartel is sort of just stuck back here looking for these guys. One, we're putting heavy fire down so you can move in. Skelly, I'm so sorry, bro. <laughs> Suppression is still going on. Uh, squad 3 INS have backed off. They think they were a little bit further west, but they're not now. JV's still stuck in this field. He's still alive, though. And he's actually pushing forward. What a boss. Eyes on enemy infantry. Direct south of me, 4. Direct south of me. They're behind you, 3 to the west. Enemy infantry, Charlie 9, 3 9. And. Dashby with the great call out there. However, Cartel's about to get walked up on. Digit is making his way up the hill. Aethel command for INS starting to make a way up from the south. And, uh, woo! Woo, lad! Mortars are getting close. Skrevsky, uh, and Viper take frag, but they're not bleeding from that mortar. And Fed's trying to do what he can to cover his guys. Fluffs gets zeroed. 
Wait, was that JB? JB throws a frag. Frag comes in. JB not hit. Oh, okay. Second frag kills JB. What a legend. Pretty sure he was the one that killed uh, Flux from that close. Mortars may have thinned out one more from British forces over here. Uh, cartel. Wait, where did Cartel go? Oh, Cartel's dead. That makes sense. He was the most southern element for no reason. Uh, and Athel's leading a fire team by himself. Command starting to get in here. Meanwhile, up north, let's take a look because the Brits are in town. We're starting to clear building by building. We've got uh, one squad on fire support, one squad actually inserted. We got a squad four for British are holding the southwest flank. Zero 12. Thrasher gets zeroed as he gets close to a building. And Hovis is going to start. Uh, oh, mad lad. Steve O is up top, second floor here. Hovis goes in through the window. And a grenade. Hovis takes advantage, but doesn't anticipate Mr. Raggy also in the second floor. One SL dead for a rifleman is not a bad trade. Great thinking Von Hovis' part to get up the stair there. Three squads now lined up in the south for INS, and they're starting to push north. Meanwhile, Frost as a squad is starting to reinforce north side of the town. This is the objective for British. They have to take this, and they got to push east. So this is point one. They have to secure this radio, then they push through point two all the way to point three. INS grenade lands near Freestalker. He's okay. Squad two is maneuvering around to the north. They could be a real big part here right now. Uh, How's it going? That it all depends if Skrevsky doesn't get shot in the back here. Oh, look at this. Jam, Mathalias, Rich on the ridge line looking for targets. Crazy Mike in the foreground here on British. And he's scanning. I think he heard jam and token over here on the ro on the, ro on the rock. And oh no! Can I get my can I get my packets back, please? Thanks, game. Okay. AK fire randomly going out here. Crazy Mike, Rich is in the open. Does Crazy Mike see Rich? Yes, he does. No, he doesn't. And Crazy Mike gets pinked in the neck and he's gone down. I think that was Jam. No. Maybe Math Elias. Lots of contact here. And Brits are still dealing with it. Brits uh, looking pretty. Uh, they look like the one squad down to fire team strength. That's Saber now running okay, one. Lemon, I'm coming Make here. sure someone's watching south. They, he's got a squad and a half to deal with. He's got like a two squads to deal with right here. That's not happening for him. Sven still being held in reserve. Squad two, northwest, starting to push southeast into town. Inus numbers still strong, about two squads uh, strength in the town. Mortars coming in. Man, right as I go away, there's always contact happening. Skretsky's still up. Frag eats Viper alive. Saber gets out of there, but he's still bleeding. Skrevsky, more grenades. Man, Sound like more grenades. Saber's still bleeding. Scope Sergeant grabs Toasty out of the middle of the line uh, of the uh, the hill here. Okay, and British are starting to get a better for a better position here. Skrevsky. And Lemon Sledge. Lemon is it? Lemon Sledge being shot in the open. Digit gets a kill. And a second. Uh, Skrebsky is killed by someone else. Probably Salty Toast. Digit looking down the hill, looking for more Brits. Coming. All the Brits are. Brits over here in the southwest are scrunched up. 
but the INS are walking past them. INS, massive reinforcement here. Now about three squads on point. Uh, not looking yeah, good for I British. Over that hill. If Pretty I'm head. being honest. Medic. Uh, straight East question mark. Between 105 and 120. So three's gone. Let's, uh, let's see. Lemon. Lancer might have eyes on someone eventually. I think that might have been Freestalker throwing a grenade there. Not uh, not the distance you're looking for. Meanwhile, uh, Brits have lost everyone in town here. Brits are holding uh, the north side here, looking to try to effect an assault. South into the village. Remember, Brits have to clear the radio. As you can see, the, uh, the hourglass icon on your screen here is where the radio is located. Mr. Raggy is the uh, squad lead that I think was starting here. INS pretty strong. They even have time to maneuver, but Frost, one of the squad leads that was reinforcing from the northeast, finds himself stuck behind a half wall. AR has got himself pinned, or AR has pinned his position here. It's not all roses for uh, INS, but it's looking pretty good. INS approaching a two to one ratio here. Um, -da 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 -da. Call that 10 here, plus six, and another four here. So 20 remaining, tw about 20 remaining here for British against a uh, three plus squad size force. This is actually a really good position for British. Silent and Dashby, or Silent actually has an AR and he's just poking down the road here with an AR looking for anything to shoot. Are you, has anyone seen you all the way up there? Wait, what? We initially took contacts back, uh... There's a squad here, do I... Come back! Okay, I want you to... Move south! Oh my gosh, there's a whole squad for British just sitting here. What are they? You might be able to get you around them. Copy. So this is Dashby's plan is to take the radio and then have these guys continue on to the final objective? INS's entire force is deployed to defend this first uh, training camp here. Dash B wants to sneak a town to sneak a squad around. Uh Blue Monk just walks in the front door. Catches Greg pants with the uh, with his pantaloons down. Okay, okay. And I uh, British have a foothold here. Further west, Revy reporting in, he's got himself a little bit of a safe haven here. Mortars landing close to the base of fire position, west side of town. Silent bugs out from his hill. Okay, I will try and find you in this point. Silent with an MMG. Top of this ridge. Five starting to move south, but they're moving like southeast. I think they're heading towards the second town. One's down, they're probably on a hill. Yeah. British making uh, British squad two effectively got a strong foothold north town north side of town here. Kalata 1991 eats a grenade. What a throw there by uh, by Honu hurt him down downstairs, and Honu wants to get in the war here, and he's got a chance. Phil Nye's denying this. Denying him the look outside, but uh. Honu is just going to wait for the Brits to come to him. Revy and his medic. Uh, always medic, liberal pundit. Still up. Still in position here. Same. Polish Serb. Going to walk straight past Honu. Polish Serb, rather. Walk straight past Honu. And Honu uses a little bit of the confusion there to get upstairs again. Repositioning. Mortars landing. Nightmare actually eats that one. He's still alive, but he's bleeding. He's down past half health. 
And the base of fire squad starting to add in. Beautiful. Nice job, guys. Spin. Oh, this actually pushed Salty Toast and a fire team back. I think that's a little bit of disarray here, and the Brits have a strong push onto the objective. Squad size force still here, and they have plenty of support. Although it's just two squads, really, for British. Uh, in the fight, Squad 5 is leapfrogged to the next objective. They can't, uh, they can't count it towards their goal until they uh, take the radio out here. Hanu getting shot. Assault the points in order. So head bus to your current assault on point two. You are not allowed to assault that until the first point is fully cleared. Copy. Yeah. Yeah, you gotta come back. You went to the wrong town. Uh oh. The uh, or the order wasn't clear. Yeah, no, I said Fox is down there if you'd like. You just could not enter the town and then begin assaulting it. Yeah, so cut, cut back, Ines down to six in the town now. Frost has moved a uh, fire team size element, including himself. Could have problems here if he sneaks up on Silent. Silent's definitely got to be looking for the town, though. Where is Silent looking? Yeah, he's looking for a place to mount his uh, MMG, and he's found it. Trying to make sure no one sneaks around to the south and the west of the British element. Revy making great work here to the point. He's starting to push east. 8-2. Oh, who's still alive in this building. Great job, man. We're going to try and push him. And rounds. He's not afraid to take some peeks here. Phil Nye has been looking at him for the longest time. I went through all my fucking bandages. We're gonna have another skull later on. What? Yeah, so we, we have one more building on this side that's not clear. We have one building on this side that's not clear. Okay. Okay. Well, I think we're giving them as much love as they're giving us, which is good. Squad three, Frost starting to starting to poke. I bet you he's gonna turn east soon, but he may not be in time. Silent and Dashby are starting to move further into town. INS still holding about a squad and a half outside of the town here. Taking contact from the southeast. Taking contact. Skeller bringing up a good point. We are on a vanilla op. They weren't from in town. So that means that everyone has binocs because for some reason OBI anyway, thinks everyone deserves binocs. In the mod, we take this away for re regular riflemen. Yep. Mortar is off target by a good 30 to 40 meters. Now even further. Hey, command, this is while we're taking accurate mortar fire. Gotcha. Said accurate mortar fire? It's close. Frost is uh, shifting now. They're in the open, guys. This is not good. If any of the British people look west, uh, Frost is going to have his cover blown. The Brits are just moving. Does Frost take a look here? Yes. Yes, Frost sees Gimli. Does he want to take shots? He's holding fire. The Brits aren't looking west. That can't last forever. And the Brits are, looks like they've positioned themselves east. Frost and his fire team, beware in wags. I think they're going to try to commit, to try to coordinate some of that mortar fire. Mortar is a little late. Would have been good about 30 seconds earlier. Anyway, as I was uh, saying, Skelly makes a good point. Not everyone has uh, Minox in the mod, but everyone does now. But because of the terrain, the foliage, Mortar's just walking right, walking towards him. Oh, and there we go. 
That sounded close. And from behind, Frost is charging. Frost looking for more. Fulcrum turns around. Benediction. And I think he saw... Oh! Rounds hitting Gimli. And grenades coming down the hill. Uh, ooh, okay, that's a smoke. See a pirate. Good luck in uh, basic. Little bit of. Uh, Negative. This is round two of a one life event, which means we'll be done with this operation after this. Uh, after the. Uh, the team has claimed victory here. Right now, kind of hard to tell. I don't have all my statistics available. By the white smoke. Brits squad five now starting to get back in here. Still a good 400 meters away from the village. And they might get intercepted here. They might have a little bit of a hard time getting here. For some reason, Headbust is also just charging ahead here by himself. Which is cool. Frost's still alive. Gimli taking shots as he tries to crawl from cover to cover here. They close to us? Gives it a gives it a solid South miss. West. More smokes being added here, and beware. To my to beware causing problems. So, Brits still haven't crossed the road south here. Their objective is this fob radio in this village, and then they have to push down the road to two other bases or potential bases and clear the whole patrol out. Lib is uh, looking for these guys behind, sticking with his command. Oh, I guess that is the Susat. I thought it was the ACOG. Okay, we're gonna dig in until five gets here, because there's no point us dying. And Revy's yeah, gonna I hold. Think he could be on the rocks, like in five, the bushes, the directly south between the houses. Now. Southeast. Looks like uh, Frost has died over here, uh, though. It's just wags. Oh, and Rich found Squad 5. Man, if they want to throw some grenades, Brits might have uh, enough range plus the hill bouncing to get Rich here. Rich trying to move and scoot, shoot and scoot. And Mathalia is going to throw a smoke, try to get a Rich out of here. Rich going to throw his own smoke towards the British forces. Rich is going to move past the smoke. At least more smokes are coming in, though. All the smokes are being thrown. Squad 5 looks like they probably reoriented here. Yeah, they're reoriented northeast. So, taking a look here, only three INS remain in the village. Squad 5 fire team size force northeast. They're trying to get out of here. I think Rich feels stuck here. I think Five just lost a man too. Uh, the remaining squad, about, uh, well, I guess it's Fire Team Plus size force here. Ines should fall back. Ines are definitely outnumbered here. I thought, I mean, for the longest time, I thought British were outnumbered, but it turns out INS are outnumbered. Hey, INS have nothing else anywhere here. They've even pulled the mortar man off. They still have 150 ammo back left at that uh, that base to use. So it's, uh, although it's not out of the woods yet there for uh, Brits. Brits, looks like Revy wants to make the assault here. Smoke's gone out. And they're pushing towards the objective. Blue Jericho and Killer J. Ow. Great spots. So maybe more than just three in the town here. Did I miss these guys? I did. I'm okay for now. Aethel's dead. Doing, so command has gone down for Brits. He's in this house somewhere. Is the, are you in it? Are you in the building? So no. six are holding the area for uh, INS now. And here we go. Okay, I'm with you. 
Who's okay. here? It's Mr. Raggy upstairs. Yep. You, you radio upstairs. Oh, hey, radio's above. Radio's above. Look. I'm um, okay. Nate out. Yeah. We're we gonna try to throw a native. We should be able to spray these floors, right? Uh oh, it almost fell back uh, downstairs. Revy almost kills himself. Uh oh. I may have lost connection here. Oh no. I lost connection here. It looks like a frag came downstairs and ended. Okay. I no, it's not. We're not dead. We're here. We're here. We're here. I lost my my connection. Did something weird. That was weird. Uh, is Sully alive? No, Sully's an admin. Why am I thinking he's alive here? Uh, but looks like uh, Hovis died. So it's just Jericho and Killer J holding the point. Lots happened there in that last uh, in that last 15 seconds. Nope. Did anyone? Do you know who uh, I, no, I don't think we did. Uh, we needed that house, but then my entire squad died assaulting it while I was trying to cover them. Uh, okay. What house? Um, here's what we're gonna do. Hang on. Four and two. You guys are gonna get in the town on the east side. Brit's gonna set up to do the exact same thing again. Because we need your bodies over here. You come in from their angle. And be the house. INS have completely withdrawn from the west, or sorry, from the east, and all the INS forces are now into town. It's kind of hard to tell from the map. You just have to go for it, Edmos, and be aggressive. Two and four, we gotta make as much noise to occupy the building. No, no, no. Shots ringing out from the uh, south side of town. Blue Monk. I think he's by himself. Silent on the MMG is looking for people to shoot. Might have spotted Silas uh, skylining there and took a few shots. Where is this dude? There's one in the tree, 139. Yeah, there's one that sounds like he's shooting from the window of the building, but I can't see I him. Dead. Um, Might have been talking about Appa there. Shortly. Yeah, but I want you to try and Can you come where I live? Okay. Rock865 might have just traded with the Liberal there. Yeah, Best, I need you taking the south side. You gotta be on the south side of the road. Head buster with eight guys. Or I can count. Yeah, that's eight guys. Double diamond there. I need you to clear out those enemies south side of the road and help take the two buildings south. Uh oh, I think squad one saw him. Nope. Appa has the best chance to find, but I think Appa's on the sec on the bottom floor. Need your whole squad moving fast as they can. Appa's got his uh, attention looking at the British force to his northwest. Meanwhile, Brits to the east with a with a fire team as a uh, base of fire an assault is moving through. B Cars net didn't want to show it to us. Hey look. My net is fine. My connection just hated me there for a second. It's okay. It happens. It happens, guys. It happens. All squads be advised. I'm north. I'm trying to cover your northwest. So if I go down, they are behind you. Brits have... Got a pretty strong position here in the east. Silas and Hamadi uh, for INS. It's sort of okay, so Hamadi yeah. crawling towards. Hamadi's trying to head bust us looking. No, he's going to walk past him. Uh, oh, and shots come out. Nice. Blue Jericho through the building. The kills the head busta. And I imagine Silas and Hamadi. Oh, 
Wait, so Silas is dead? How did Silas get spotted? Oof. Amadi back here by himself then. And Biker wants to watch the window. He sees. Oh, he's getting shot. He's getting shot. No, maybe that's him shooting. He's shooting and hitting the rock. Yeah, he's shooting and hitting the rock. View models. I don't think we're taking any fire right now. Salty Toast bringing the rest of two, starting to slowly work west side. And Dashby's got to get in the fight here. He's lost so many people. Biker gets killed on the on that hill on the rock lot the rock side there i think amadi might have done it to him just and the base of fire element is now caught up on the side here and they're starting to push through one pump coming to the rescue here oh nice grenade amadi actually eats it Like that, don't you, Dash B? Not when you're shooting him. Oh my gosh. Oh, and they're just running across. Someone Lewis is just rolling. Fulcrum. A fire team size force now yeah, around the building. Alright, so there's two INS, second floor of the building. Adam holding this room. Uh, you wanna push think, in? We think that it's a building. Briefing. You guys. Four. It's one of the two. Moving to the I'm left side of the room. This building now. Door clear. I got one at least. Can I? Nade. Frag. I'm up. I'm gonna nade the nice stairs. Nade him. Fuck, just throw nades at the top floor. Nade the top floor, nade. boys. Nade. 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 Jericho makes Keep alive. Going. Don't push. Here we go. You fuck more eyes. They don't push. Keep nading. Need the top floor. Jericho okay. actually hit a bit of frag there, and he's bled. He was bleeding there for a second. Brits are surrounding this building right now. There are still some INS outside. Blood, blood, blood. The radio actually took damage there. Killer J with the. Laser on that stairwell. It's starting to get loud. We have a new context for the Jericho takes out Lewis's face. Spin trying to pre fire Killer J on the post there is not oh. happening. Yeah, where is? Here? Give me here. He's in this bottom room. Yeah, yeah. I don't think they realize there's still two in here. Imanaz is going to throw a grenade. Hey, that could, uh, that could do something. Jericho, can he get out in time? He does not. He eats the grenade. He goes down. Right, so the second one. Oh, oh no, the second one. Go back, go back, go back, go back. Copy. All right, go. Blood. Here Take we go. Oh. Even else trades with Are Killer J. God damn it. It's clear on the building. I just don't, don't know it yet, but they've There's lost the objective. Up. Blue Monk is engaged with Salty Toast. Salty Toast trying to put a bullet into uh, Blue Monk. Alright, I want you to fucking throw it through this window. And Alzadi is still way out there. Selfie Toast running down with a pistol, trades with Blue Monk. There's a window on the Makarov. West side. Throw it through there. Doing work. And, uh, wow, the Brits have done it. Guys, they're still coming from the south, I think. I think Brits one down two. to two, four, five. Versus one. And the Brits are throwing grenades into the empty building. They don't know it yet. And Sven is about to clear it. Sven's cleared it. Now I'm Sven. I'm coming. Uh oh. Blue on blue. Top floor. I think he's dead. Yep. Top floor clear. Top floor is clear. Radio's going down. An objective has been taken. Alzadi. Radio's getting dipped. Not down. Dashby with the uh, is Dashby's gonna, Dashby's going to win with that fire team fire team size force here. Uh, Buxo. Uh -huh. Holding the outside. Oh, he gets one tapped by Alzadi. Alzadi's still up. Silent holding the back side. Might be able to catch this guy. Yeah. Alzadi looking for windows to shoot through. Ain't happening. Alzadi gonna make a run for it. And he gets zinged by Silent. And I think that does it. The Brits have done it with four remaining. 
five guys. And that's GG. Oh, Spin meeps on the point dash B silent supporting. And that does it. And even dash B surprised. What a way to win. What an intense assault. Dash B doesn't even know what's going on right now in the thing. Wow, what a way to end, guys. Woo! That's going to do it for us. Thank you guys so much for watching Squad Ops today. Um, we got a basic. It's probably already started by now. It's not going to start soon. Um, actually, you may have already missed roll call for it. Um, but...